Peace and blessings. Welcome to Goat James Kingdom. On this episode, we're going to discuss who is better offensively between Michael Jordan and LeBron James. Recently, we've been having discussions with Michael Jordan fans about LeBron James's greatness on the offensive side of the floor. These Michael Jordan fans cannot accept that LeBron James is actually great on the offensive side of the floor, let alone greater than Michael Jordan. They like to think that Michael Jordan on the basketball court did everything and was phenomenal at it as well. But we have never argued that Michael Jordan was not great on the offensive side of the floor. We just argued that LeBron James does more and that LeBron James is greater on the offensive side of the basketball court. And as usual, we use stats and accolades to prove our case, but Michael Jordan fans cannot accept it. So here we will go ahead and show you how LeBron James is a better offensive player than Michael Jordan. Now here are the categories we're going to use to measure both of these players' offensive ability. We have scoring, passing, playmaking, field goal percentage, three-point percentage, triple doubles, and double doubles. Now, since they do not like career numbers because obviously LeBron James is just phenomenal when it comes to career numbers, we're just going to use games played and the type of games that these players put up for their teams for their careers. Now first, let's just go to scoring. Everything about Michael Jordan is about his 30 point per game average, but we always tell Michael Jordan fans it's about the amount of shots you take to get those amount of points. Now we all know Michael Jordan has the most 30 point games all time, but who has the most 30 point games between Michael Jordan and LeBron taking less? than 20 field goal attempts that's lebron 92 to 44 lebron doubles the amount of games at 30 points in that game while taking less than 20 field goal attempts than michael jordan but let's take it to the 40 point games if we look at 40 point games for their career where they took less than 20 field goal attempts in that game lebron james also doubles michael jordan there but I hear already coming out of your mouths is why do we limit it to only 20 field goal attempts? But even if we look at less than 25 field goal attempts for 30 point games, LeBron James has over 350. Mike only has 210. If we go to the 40 point games with under 25 field goal attempts taken, now you'll see that Michael Jordan has more of those games, but by two over LeBron James. So what these numbers are showing us is that LeBron James is a more efficient scorer than Michael Jordan. Even if we take it to the playoffs, if we look at the 30 point games in the playoffs with less than 20 field goal attempts LeBron James has triple Jordan in that category if we go to the 40 point games with under 20 field goal attempts that's where Michael Jordan gets LeBron because he has one LeBron has zero but if we take it to the 25 attempts or less in the playoff game, LeBron James has more 30 point games in that scenario. And that is the most of all time, over twice as much as Michael Jordan has. He also has the same in 40 point games with under 25 field goal attempts within that same game. So even in the playoffs, we can see that LeBron James is a more efficient scorer than Michael Jordan. He doesn't need to take the amount of shot attempts that Jordan had to take to score the amount of points that they score. So LeBron James is just a better scorer than Michael Jordan so in scoring we're going to go ahead and give that to LeBron but if we move on to actually passing and playmaking we can see here that LeBron James is also the better player when it comes to this offensively if we look at the amount of regular season games that LeBron James has 30 points and 10 assists in he also doubles Michael Jordan in that if we look at games where LeBron James has 35 points and 10 assists in he actually has more of those games than Michael Jordan if we go to games with 40 points and 10 assists LeBron James has more of those games than Michael Jordan. And if we even take it to the playoffs, LeBron James has more 30 and 10 assist games than Michael Jordan, the most of all time. He has the most 35 and 10 assist games, the most of all time and more than Michael Jordan. He has the most 40 point 10 assist games the most of all time and more than Michael Jordan. So all of this is showing us that LeBron James is better offensively than Michael Jordan. He actually contributes more to his team offensively on a game to game basis. But Michael Jordan fans only want to credit Jordan for being a shot taker, not an actual play maker. And when we add playmaking to the category, LeBron James is just a superior offensive player. He gets more double doubles and he gets more triple doubles. And with all this information provided to Michael Jordan fans, all they do is bring up how Michael Jordan should be able to take a bunch of shots because he was making his shots. They like to assume that his 49.7% is 50%. But in reality, does Michael Jordan really shoot 50%? No, if we look at the amount of seasons that Michael Jordan shot over 50% for his career, it was only done six times out of the 15 seasons. LeBron James has double that amount than Michael Jordan. How many seasons has Michael Jordan actually shot over 55%? Zero. 
LeBron James has done that twice. And then if we take it to three-point shooting, which they love to assume Michael Jordan is also better than LeBron James at, how many seasons did MJ have where he shot above 35% from the three-point line? Only five out of the 15. LeBron has also doubled that. If we take it to the playoffs, how many seasons did Michael Jordan shoot above 50% in a postseason? He's only done that five times out of the 13 postseasons he has. LeBron James has done that eight times, more than Michael Jordan. How about the postseasons where Michael Jordan shoots above 55%? zero LeBron's done that three times and lastly if we look at the three-point shooting during the postseason Jordan matched seven seasons with LeBron James at shooting 35% or above so with all of these numbers and all of these statistics that show LeBron James is the better offensive player than Michael Jordan these guys are going to continue to argue with us but as we always stated you're safe in the comments you can catch us Sunday noon if you want to debate goodbye LeBron James, LeBron James, LeBron James, LeBron James.